What's going on guys, JSGC here and we are here for another Manchester City video. Today we're going to be doing the match vlog of the game between Manchester City and Borussia Dortmund in the Champions League. It is our second match in the Champions League and we're following on from our victory against Sevilla away last week 4-0 with this game here. We didn't have a game midweek due to the Queen passing away so our match against Tottenham Hotspur at home was postponed. So it'll be interesting to see whether the players are are as sharp, uh, or whether they're quite fresh, having a little bit more of a break than maybe what they were expecting, but we'll see what happens in terms of the game. But, uh, if you are enjoying the content, then please do subscribe to my channel, that would be much appreciated. We're on that push now to 28,000 subscribers, now less than 700 subs away, so any help towards that would be much appreciated. Also, don't forget, as well, uh, social media links there in the description below and sliding across at the bottom of the screen if you want to go and follow me on my Twitter and Instagram, my email also in the description below too. If you want to hit me up for any sponsorships for any videos or any general business inquiries, do leave a thumbs up as well if you do enjoy this video. Aiming for 300 likes. Let me know your thoughts as well in the comments below and also don't forget to go and check out today's video sponsor which is brought to you by One Football. This video is brought to you by OneFootball. If you want to download the OneFootball app, all you need to do is press the link at the top of my description, which will take you forward to where you can download this app. The OneFootball app is extremely useful if you are a huge football fan just like me. It provides you with the latest footballing news, transfer news, and the latest videos as well. It is one source of information of where I get my transfer news from. It also allows you to see the latest scores with what's happening in the footballing world if you just click on a game including any Manchester City game it will not only bring up the latest team news but it will also bring up the latest statistics and keep you up to date with everything happening in that game if you want to download this app all you need to do is press the link at the top of the description to stay up to date thank you very much to one football for sponsoring this video if you want to go and check them out and then all details and everything are in the description so we're going to go and head towards the Etihad so let's Let's go. City, we're going with Stone to the looks like right back, but I think we're going back three rather than back four. Uh, Cancelo on the left, Akanji and Ake on uh, centre back. Rodri, Gundogan, De Bruyne through the middle. Uh, Mares on one side on the right, Grealish on the left, Howland through the middle. I'm surprised that we're not starting Foden, considering how well he did uh, in against Dortmund over the two legs last time. Bernardo doesn't start as a surprise as well, uh, but hopefully we've got enough to allow us to go and win this game and get the three points. It is all that matters. Uh, Julian Brandt sits on the bench for Dortmund. Uh, that's a surprise. Um, but they've got Bellingham starting, Marco Royce. Still got the bits of quality there, so you need to be careful. For. Uh, so we're just in the pre-match build-up now. We're going to have a minute silence for the death of the Queen very soon. There's no anthem, no advertisement buzz, and wondering why. That's why um, we'll have to kick off the game. Come on, sis.
Manchester City wishes to express its sincere condolences to the royal family following the passing of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. Her Majesty's dedication and service has been exemplary. We join our country and the Commonwealth in mourning her loss. We will now take a moment to reflect on her life and her legacy with minutes of silence, which will begin and end on the referee's whistle. never rated the food here so this is seven pound 25 chicken and chips they've run out of cheese so chips they smothered in barbecue sauce um go with this one that's not bad for football chips the chicken nice just a little cold Give it a rating out of 10, I'd probably sit in a solid 6 out of 10. Half time here at the Etihad to give some thoughts. Nothing's happened. Hallen's uh, been ineffective and he's been ineffective because Sule and Matt Summers have just done their job properly. And because of that, Man City have looked very ineffective. I think I'd be looking towards the bench. Foden, uh, Bernardo Silva, Julian Alvarez. These are players I'd be looking at towards the second half and bringing them on. Craig, what do you think? Fairly boring to be fair, like you said, two dollar set of halves, dollar set of games. It's been more direct, more to go left to right, left to right, a bit more direct. Maris keeps cutting in, doesn't he? Yeah, keeps cutting in, also a bit of a side attack on just now, so I think it's a down there.
And that, ladies and gentlemen, concludes today's match vlog. I do hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy this video, then please leave a thumbs up. That would be much appreciated. Also, don't forget as well to let me know your thoughts in the comments below as well. That would be fantastic. Subscribe to my channel. If you are new around here, press that red button, press the bell, and put your push notifications on. Also, don't forget as well, check out my social media links. They're in the description below and sliding across at the bottom of the screen if you want to go and follow me on my Twitter and Instagram. My email also in the description below too. If you want to hit me up for any sponsorship for any videos or any general business inquiries. Don't forget as well to go and check out today's video sponsor, which is brought to you by OneFootball. Link to them there in the description, OneFootball. We'll keep you up to date with all the latest football news, transfer news, latest scores, results, statistics, live league tables, and all your good footballing needs. Lastly, I'm going to rate because on my last video, uh, people were saying I was a bit unfair in terms of atmosphere and things and what I normally do with my match vlogs. So, uh, we're going to start first with atmosphere. For atmosphere, South Stand Level 1, always my record recommendation if you've never been to a City game. I absolutely love it there. Um, atmosphere was brilliant. I thought it was a really good European night atmosphere at the Etihad. Dortmund fans were brilliant. I thought City fans were good as well. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Uh, in terms of food and drink, um, not brilliant, if I'm honest. The, the pint was a little bit better that I had this time than what it was last time. Again, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. And finally, in terms of value for money, I think the ticket cost me, I think, £27. Not bad value at all for a decent quality football game, so I'm going to give that an 8 out of 10, giving it an overall score today, if my maths is correct, uh, of 23 out of 30, which does mean that that works out at an average of nearly 8 out of 10, I think it's like 7.66 out of 10, so a much better experience, like I said, always recommended South Stand Level 1. So I'll be back again real soon for more match vlogs, watch-alongs, previews, reviews, transfer updates, all your good footballing needs, some Subscribe to my channel. It's very late. We'll get this edited up, get it out there, and I'll see you all again real soon. So I've been JSGC. Thank you everyone for watching. Peace. Ciao for now.